forehand. Oh, you kidding? Yeah, that was it. Good. Extra points for the pirouette. That is just a joke of a shot. That is an unbelievable shot. That's the shot of the day. Brings the crowd to life. And those are the kind of points that we've become so used to seeing from Murray over the years. And that's a really good sign because it is on the left-hand side. So you'd imagine the backhand is a little bit more painful than the forehand. She's moving to her left. Comes up with a nice backhand winner. The slice from Golovic far too short. Brilliant. Saw Gerard was on a roll towards his wide forehand and spiked it down the backhand side. Lovely back behind here. Yeah. Five. He can look all arms and legs at times. 85 kilos. There we are. Just sat up nicely for him. Put away with venom. 91 miles an hour of forehand. Oh, she's found the line. That is wonderful from Bolton. Brilliant anticipation. And what control as well. From the British number one. I always would have thought she'd won the point there, but... Oh, it's terrific play. Nice and composed. Radicanu can enjoy that one. Mm. Hit freely. Oh, good effort. Not quite the full dive. Fritz leads by four games to two. It's what we want to see. <laughs> True grass court tennis. <laughs> dive volley. Yeah, he, he was he was airborne actually. A <laughs> bit harsh on him. Oh well, I'm a little surprised that Cressy didn't stop the point there. He thought about it. He thought the second serve was long. I thought the second serve was long. He thought about stopping it and challenging. Decided against it. Well. Oh, he rolled the dice, he went for the flash down the line, and he found it. Another Feels top ten strike from Hewitt. Feels as though he's really just stepped up and left. Oh, wonderful. That was worth the run. Lost the team. That's the best feeling ever when you do this. The 
Vincent. That was already an incredible get from Haddad Maya on that last volley from Petra, really digging it out from the ground. <laughs> Two six footers uh, covering the court beautifully. Better. Oh, just like he's got his opponent on a string. Great defense of his court. The British number two working so hard, straining every sinew to stay in the point. And in the end, turning the point around, getting the upper hand and just nudging that backhand pass through the hole on the court. Love. Extra points for the pirouette. What a way to end the longest rally of the match. A scorching winner from Draper. That is spectacular. It's Nadal-like. And I'm not sure if, if not scampering around the baseline is... That's oh. sensational. That is on the half volley, cross court. Well, it's the best shot just best shot of the set so far by long way because that was a good volley there from Cressy he did nothing wrong there the angle there I mean look he had just no time there to react that was virtually no backswing at all the way he twisted this one yeah that's the shot of the day top of the racket almost yeah. It, that, you see how short that is? That is magnificent. And also the ball got him back behind a little bit, so yeah. he was yeah. able to... Oh. Well, there you go. There's the speed demon again. I thought Alcaraz had done enough with that cut back end. And that is volley, but there. no, he was on it, he read it, and then he managed to control that ball beautifully to wrong foot his opponent. You see how, I mean, that is sort of an ugly shot, isn't it? It's just a... made it huge from Evans the frustration is understandable for Jordan Thompson will he get a better chance than that Jeez. just gave Evans the opportunity to go past him still needed to be an outstanding backhand winner Get out of the way. 
hold that ball like that. It's helpful to have no take on the backhand side, and he yeah. develops a great deal of power there. He'd slightly overrun it. It's the old penalty down the middle here. He didn't have to move too much, but that is great hands. Oh, oh, oh he got it. He reaches it. Oh. He'll never stop fighting. He'll never stop fighting. It was sort of fitting that Dimonor. My goodness. That's a scandal from Ryan Penniston. Highlight of the week. That forehand up the line from Penniston was a fair distance wide. It wasn't called. No Hawkeye here. And understandably, Vesely stopped to make his point known, but he, he has given Penniston a little sense that he's not feeling entirely secure as he did that and uh, that is just a joke of a shot from the brit oh, oh are you kidding that was it good. A challenge from oh, Evans, what a point. Yes, for Evans, Charlie McCall in the left baseline, Bolo Skolden. Well, what a point, but well, what a big point as well. He, he played that so well, Dan Evans. And it is good. Oh, That's oh, remarkable. Oh, from that Seth Gorda. He would have liked him to have hoisted the lob up, because he didn't need to. He could have got behind, hit the lob up, and he went for the spectacular, but it came off. <laughs> 